Betty, today I have a day off because it's the um, um, Belgium French community holiday. So I have a day off. I have come for a walk uh, near my house actually. My house is up there. And because I wanted to show you a few um, trees and plants I have here near where I live. So this is, for example, a, a charcoal tree. You can see the, the berries, which are not eatable, of course, but uh, the, that tree is used to uh, make charcoal to, you know, to uh, draw. It's, a, it's something, that, a charcoal pencil to, <coughs> to make drawings. So this is a charcoal tree. And in French, it's called a fusa. And now here, this is also a tree with uh, berries, which also are not eatable by humans, but birds love them very much. And it's called um, a rosa, rosa canina in Latin because I I haven't found uh, the name in uh, in English. So this is a uh, rosa canina, rosa canina, and then a bit further is uh, I don't know the name of, of uh, those trees. This is a hazelnut tree here, very common of course, and here too. So here. Here this is holly, you know these plants we use uh, at Christmas time, there are a few uh, berries as you can see there and here but not many. You see what it is, it has horns, okay, and here too, this is the same. So this tree I wanted to show you because it is very thick. In fact, this tree got struck by lightning a few years ago. I was told it's an oak tree and look as it is very, very, very thick and it got struck. And so you see there, there is only half, half of the tree left, you see? And the other part is here. This is the other part of the tree. Okay, and a bit further too, there are slew trees. If you remember last year, I had picked up slews to prepare some liquor, which is, by the way, very delicious. <laughs> but um, this year is a, is a very bad year for the fruit and there are no slews at all on, on the trees. Nowhere. Okay, so uh, I'll finish for now, but I'll make another video to show you something else a bit later.